Bobby getting better and better and then <laughs> announcing me, man. <laughs> um, first of all, I want to give honor to God for allowing me to be here today and to stand before all of you. Um, I also want to give a big thanks to uh, the top rank um, at the whole the whole top rank nation. I want to thank everybody to get this all this thing uh, prepared, this show prepared. I want to thank uh, my team, Team Bradley, best team in the world. I want to thank all of you guys, man. Thank you so much for uh, dedicating your time and taking time of your life to get me prepared for for a goal and a dream of mine. I want to thank my wife, my manager, um, my wife, uh, my partner. I want to thank her for everything that she put up with through every training camp. Dealing with a fighter is no joke. Um, a lot of, I know there's a lot of women out there like, man, she has it easy. No, she doesn't. It is bad. We have five kids. She's my manager, and on top of that, she got to deal with the stress that I bring every single day because I'm a head case. <laughs> I want to thank my brother, man. I want to thank my brother, my brother-in-law, uh, Chris, for just always being there, man, and always helping and support. And, you know, he'll give me his dang right arm. If I need a right arm, he'll give it to me. I know he would. Uh, I want to thank him. Special thanks to him as well, and uh, my kids. I want to thank my mother for for having me. Um, I also want to thank uh, my trainer. Uh, where is he at, Mr. James Rusley? And uh, I want to thank him. I want to thank uh, Frank, my also my other trainer. I want to thank Sam Jackson over here. My whole team's not up here, but you know, I just want to thank everybody for uh, you know contributing and giving their time. I want to thank also HBO, HBO man, Premier Boxing Network. I know there's a lot of boxing on TV now, on regular cable, whatever, but that doesn't feel like boxing to me. Uh, it just doesn't. Um, I like the HBO Network and how they do it and how they present the fighters and uh, put on a show. So I want to thank HBO for bringing me back once again and believing in in the brand, the Bradley brand. Um, Stub Hub Center, 2013 Fight of the Year against Ruzan Pavanikov. This this place uh, brings back horrific <laughs> memories, horrific memories against Ruzan Pavanikov. And uh, but with that being said, I also want to thank uh, Team Vargas, his whole team up here. I want to thank them for uh, taking a fight with myself. Uh, give a shout out to Cameron Duncan, uh, my former manager. Um, other than that, um, Saturday night is gonna be a it's gonna be an entertaining fight, guys. Um, once again, I'm fighting a, another huh, young, hungry, determined uh, champion. Like I always say, bring on the best. Jesse Vargas is fighting me. He wants to prove he's a he's a better fighter than me. He's gonna come hungry and ready. Um, just real quick, I just want to just say this real quick. I have nothing against this team up here. I have nothing against you, Eric Morales. Um, what happened two days ago was on that rant was because as soon as I get out the car, I'm tired, I'm hungry, I gotta take a piss. I'm, and I hear that somebody saying something negative about myself and my team, it, it kind of caught me by surprise. So when I went off on that rant, it was because I was angry because of everything that was going on. So there's no disrespect. I got a lot of respect, lot of respect for you, Eric. I, I, I appreciate what you did in the sport. You were a tremendous fighter, Hall of Fame fighter. So there's no bad blood. I'm just letting you know that, all right? Okay? No bad blood. I just, I just had to clear that up because, uh, you know, I just feel that that everybody needs to know that I just wasn't ranting just to be ranting. I just heard that he said something about me and he said something about my team and it pissed me off. And I'm just like, dude, show some respect. That's all I felt. But um, other than that, I had a great training camp. I don't want to keep you guys too much longer. Um, Y'all know, know what I bring, man. Y'all know what I bring. I don't have to sit up here and say what I'm going to do or, you know, talk crap about Jesse. We're going to get it on Saturday night. And... Uh, Made a victor, made a victor go on and, and, and to bigger and better things. And, and uh, you know, the, the loser is going to um, have to rebuild. So I'm excited about this opportunity, fighting for the world championship. This is my fifth world champ title, not my second. I'm a two division world champion, but I got four world championships. This will be fifth, I'm going for five. 
So um, I'm excited because this belt is for my son. My, my newborn son is just, he's born three months ago. So, um, you know, um, I got, a, I got a, a vision in mind of what I want my Christmas um, cards to look like. And I want all my kids wearing a strap. All of them, all five of them gonna have a strap. That's what I want. So I'm envisioning that in my head. And that's gonna make me fight even harder because that's what I want. But thank you, hey, oh, all the media, thank you so much. If you write good things about me or bad things about me, I don't really care. Thank you. I appreciate, I, I appreciate it just you even bringing my name up. So thank you so much. I love you guys and tune in Saturday night, HBO Live. Thank you.